Welcome back. We have Bodhi Shandro joining us on the show today, who just drove down from Sun Peaks this morning. How's the weather up there? Absolutely amazing. Minus yeah. nine this morning, beautiful sunny skies. I went for a run. There's lots, not a ski run, a run run. How are you else, running it's in not the open snow? Yet. You just stay on the top. Okay. Um, but beautiful. Lots of snow over the weekend. We're looking forward to an incredible season and a great opening weekend. Both yeah. Alpine and Nordic open this weekend. Opening day Saturday? Yes. Fantastic. Uh, and you specialize uh, in off-piste camps for people who are looking for a little more adventure than what's uh, offered on the main track. Exactly. This is, we're into our third year and growing upon our success uh, over the past couple of seasons. This year we have three programs. One is our three day beyond groomers camp which is essentially guided ski instruction through all the steeps through the glades the powder and the bumps uh, then we have new this year is a guided guilds one day tour so i'm going to be personally guiding uh, guests into guilds backcountry the legendary guilds backcountry showing them the best runs but also the safest wa safest ways in safest ways out and then finally our all mountain skills camp which uh, we're really proud last season we won best new course of the year from ski canada magazine so we're continuing with that and essentially Sorry, but no, no. I, I just think it's a wonderful opportunity for people to do this because we hear so much about people going out of bounds and getting into trouble. Does this sort of teach people like this is what you're supposed to do and not supposed to do? Absolutely. The All Mountain Skills Camp was developed really focusing on safety. So promoting an awareness or developing an awareness of mountain hazards and a, pre a preparedness in terms of skills, in terms of equipment, and most importantly, attitude. So I took the training, some of the basic fundamental um, elements of my training as a ski guide and created a two-day course, it, it became apparent to me that there was a real absence of, of opportunities for recreational skiers to get out and get a, a good overview of a number of fundamental skills. So we cover everything from first aid, overnight survival, nice. um, avalanche tree wells. Uh, we have some video that was filmed by Ski TV last season on the hill. Uh, I know your, your voice is on this, uh, but tell me a little bit about this. Is this is sort of to promote what you guys do. Exactly. Exactly. We got a tremendous amount of coverage nationally and a little bit of internationally because it is a, is a brand new course uh, of its type. Typically, you know, you go from zero all the way to an AST, an avalanche skills training course, which is a very focused course, but there really isn't a lot offered in terms of the uh, fundamentals of everything. So it's not just avalanches, it's tree wells. It's, it's what happens if you get lost overnight within a ski resort boundary, but you're unable to find your way in. Is this going to be an inconvenient overnight camping trip or is this life and death? These are the types of skills that we'll teach you in the All Mountain Skills Camp. What to carry in your pack, what to have in your, in your jacket pocket, you know, both skills and equipment standpoint, and how to deal with potential situations if they arise. In this video, are you showing people the different layers of snow? Like what's going on there? Exactly. So that's the snow science component of it. We're taking a look at the layers. We start watching layers two weeks ago already. Uh, I was watching from Mexico as what's happening with the snowpack and it slowly builds over the course of the season and from there we're able to better determine safe places to ski during what periods of time. Okay, how do people sign up for these camps if they're interested? Uh, calling Sun Peaks again. Um, contact the office 578-5505 if I'm not mistaken or online. Um, yeah, and grand openings this weekend. We're taking bookings uh, as we speak. That's awesome. All right. You must love what you do, hey? I have a fantastic life. I don't take <laughs> it for granted. Thank Sounds you, like Susan. Uh, a final mention here as well, and we have a poster to show. Win a day of heli skiing. This is awesome. Yes. Thank you again to the Wiggly family up at uh, the infamous Mike Wiggly Heli Skiing. I'm also very fortunate to be a part-time guide there. They are giving away one day of heli skiing for any a draw for any of the guests that uh, come to our camps this year. And this is uh, really a first-class skiing resort for people who are good at what they do but I mean I haven't been up there I know you're an instructor up there and you've been up there uh, first class second to none. It, it is Mike Wigley's is the they set the standard it's incredible in terms of the terrain 1.2 million acres of terrain up there that's more than every resort in North America combined um, 22 beautiful hand-hewn log chalets 22,000 square foot main lodge and the best guides on the planet I mean safety is number one up there um, uh, and, you know, if you're a strong intermediate level skier, male or female, we welcome you, welcome you up to Mike Wigley's. And you're a guide up there, aren't you? I'm a part-time guide there as well. That's awesome. Good life you lead. Uh, how do people enter to win this? All they have to do is, is register for one of our off-piece camps, the Beyond Groomers, the One Day Guided Gills, or the All Mountain Skills Camp. Their name automatically goes into a draw, and we'll be drawing that at the end of the ski season. Fantastic. Bodhi Chandro, thank you for being here today. Thank you so much. Very welcome. All the information on the screen looks complicated, but if you use the phone number 578-5505, that might just be the easiest way. We're back in two minutes. Stay with us.